All right, welcome back to the channel and welcome to Firebox Breaks. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to get to part two here on this mini series of 2024-2025 Tim Hortons NHL trading cards. Now, we opened up 25 in part one, 25 packs that is, and we pulled some pretty interesting cards. So, Go back and check out what was the hit card. I showcased some at the end, but I'm not spoiling it this time. So go back and check out that video and see what was found. So we are going to get into this as mentioned. So just before we do, the hard to hit cards are 1 in 1800 packs. Those are NHL jersey relics. And of course, NHL signatures are 1 in 7,200 packs. And it's almost 1 in 87,000 packs for NHL signature jersey relics. Finally, Crosby and Nathan McKinnon each have superstar signature cards that are well over 1 in every 125,000 packs each. So, can we get one of those? That would be awesome if we could. But we are definitely going to get to it. And I mentioned there were some other harder to hit packs that we looked into getting of course frozen hot shots one and three true north one and four packs pure gold one and seven above the ice one and eight but you have some other retrospectives so one in 24 packs will get you this sydney crosby retrospective so we hit one there we should get another one here in this video so that was a fairly lengthy introduction as a normal but here we are we're just going to get to it you've seen most of the base cards by now so we're just going to get the focus on right there on Tippett and Cole Perfetti get to the goods Kale McCarr True North Future right there so that is your first one and we're going to just get to the goods because we had a lengthy and that is again just for focus purposes we have a frozen hot shots this one is Cole Caulfield and that is your first one for this offering of 25 packs. Third pack in. Now, as mentioned, I'm, I'm trying to get one of those massive cards. We did not get any of those thus far on the channel. And we've got a Leon Dreisaitl Frozen Hot Shots. Boom! Edmonton Oilers flavor right there. So that is pretty cool. That one will definitely sit well in the personal collection all right here we are we're making some headway we're doing well and we've got laffy taffy but we've got a jason robertson frozen hot shots there we are now i will definitely focus in on the hit cards but you know the base cards although they're pretty solid to look at they are a lot of foil action right there and connor mcdavid why not showcase McJesus? Behind McJesus, we've got a rat sighting. Rat Marchand of the rat comes out to play. McDavid says no way. All right, here we go. If you've watched that series about the NHL playoffs last year, it was pretty interesting to see a heated McDavid. Of course, that was interesting, though. From a Oilers fan perspective, I'm glad to have seen the passion in that player and of course the willingness to win as for this player here nope no willingness to win just excuse after excuse but here we are for those of you that know me i'm not really a big fan of pld here we are we've got kurashev we've got a jacob chikrin and the hit card is joseph wall pure gold with the buds the leafs and it's not that i don't like the teams that he's played for just when a player consistently complains about their team it's not a good thing it's like own up take some ownership and go from there all right Makar, we've got a josh morrissey and we've got a connor bedard true north futures right there so bedard sighting that's pretty cool connor bedard all right we're doing well we're nine packs in we have a byfield right there we've got a robert thomas now Bobby Brink in motion phenoms. Bobby Brink. Now, these rookies are technically a holdover from last year. So you see those names. 
it's just a little surprising that they're still in the 24-25 series. Lucas Reichel, we've got a Malkin. Looks to be one of the hot shots coming up right there. We've got a Connor Bedard. Hot shots. Boom. Connor Bedard. That is a pretty solid card. So Bedard sighting. Doing well. And let's carry on. So have you had a chance to pick up some Tim Hortons? Maybe not. If you live in Canada, definitely go over there. Pick up some Tim Hortons. We got Matthew Petra, the in motion phenoms there. Pick up some Tim Hortons. Maybe ask for my address. Maybe send these to Firebox Breaks and I'll open up for you. I'll add them to my collection as well. Just say, Mr. Firebox Breaks, I enjoy your breaks, your content, your excitement. And I decided to send you some packs of cards just to support your channel. We got Eichel, we've got Power, we've got A. Not shall be named. That one will go off to the side. Terrible player, attitude wise. But here we are. And say, Firebox Breaks, you, you do well. I enjoy your content. And this is my appreciation for your channel. Guy Kutrov, we've got A. Alex Newhook, and we've got Above the Ice. Alex Ovechkin, oven chicken right there. And as mentioned, I'll gladly take those. I think just to finish my set would be awesome. Usually at the end of my breaks on the four-part mini-series, I total what I was uh, given in terms of a box. Sanderson, Brett Burns, and we've got a Sidney Crosby, True North Future, right there. And I always total up the packs it takes to complete the set. Well, not the packs, but the, the number of well, what a box will yield and basically output and then give you some percentages. We've got a Hot Shots coming up. Ryan O'Reilly, Shifley, we've got a Nikita Kucherov right there. And that is always a staple of this mini-series. Give me a second. <clears throat> Just had to get a drink of Canada Dry. That is your drink straight from Canada right there. So made in Canada, the little symbol right there. So Canada Dry, not a sponsor of this video, but that is... What I use to sort of quench my thirst. All right, let's get to it. So 10 packs remain of the second offering of 25 packs here on Firebox Breaks. These cards, packs are falling all over on the side. Connor Bedard, boom, there we are. Another Bedard card. We've got a Claude Giroux and we've got a Sidney Crosby Frozen Hot Shots. Boom, we are doing well. That is interesting enough. Another Connor Bedard card. There's like three of those so far, if not two. Definitely hot shots. We've got his regular card, Matt Zuccarello. We've got a Mitch Marner, True North Future. Followed up with Vazilevsky. All right, so there we are. We're doing well. I'm just going to move these two cards here, actually. Put another pile there so it's easier to manage on the recap. So far, so good. Two episodes in. We've got a Stutzla there. We've got a Natchez. We've got a Quinn Hughes. Pure gold right there. So second offering of the four-part miniseries. The fifth one is generally a recap, and maybe I'll open up a few more packs. We'll see how it goes there. Seth Jones. We've got Couturier. We've got a Alex Ovechkin. Hot shots. So far, we've had some pretty solid names. And we're doing well. All right. And we're definitely cutting some time down. The last video was approximately 15 minutes. Backlin, we've got a Marchand. We have a Pedersen above the ice. All right. So five packs to go and doing well. And my objective, as we do all the time, is to sort of shorten every video. Power, we've got a Philip Forsberg, and we've got a Bo Horvat. And that actually might be a double. I think I've got a Horvat in that one already. But nonetheless, we're having fun. Always look forward to Tim Hortons every single year. We've got a Debrinket there, Alex Debrinket, Alex Tuck, and Sidney Crosby Retrospective. So that is the only one we're going to get for this one here. All right, so that is... Shouldn't be a double. SC8. I'm not sure if I got SC8 on the last one. Just give me a quick second. 
We have a, no, that is SC7. So doing well, no duplicates thus far in those hard to hit cards. One in every 24 packs, so basically you need two boxes. Matthews and we've got Quinn Hughes. Oh, we've got another Sidney Crosby. Boom. Well, that's pretty cool. So we just defied the odds. We got two Crosbys in in the same offering of 25 packs. Normally, you get one for 24. Boom. We just shattered the odds yet again on fire box break. So... Marc-Andre Fleury with the pretty cool throwback jersey there. Thompson and Connor McDavid right there. True North future. That is a hot card nonetheless. A hit card as well for the Edmonton Oilers PC here on Firebox Breaks. So here we are, the 25th pack, Marcia So. Dylan Strowman, we've got a Miko Rantanen, so pretty cool right there. So we've done fairly well. <coughs> All right, give me a quick second. Had to drink some water, got some Canada Dry, and we will do a very quick and modest recap here. For part two, I think it's better we do it this way. All right, so we're going to start off with the True North Future. One, two, three, four, five, six of these. True North Future with Connor McDavid right there leading the pack. That's pretty cool. So six of those. Frozen Hot Shots, we have a bit more of those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine Frozen Hot Shots. Why don't we give Bedard his due? Put him right there for a recap picture there. What else? We have two of these Pure Golds. We have three of the above the ice with Pedersen there. And we've got a few more to showcase. We've got two in motion phenoms. We have one pure gold or did we mess up? I think we added, yeah. So we had three pure gold. I just put that one off to the side. So it kind of skewed our results just a little bit. And we had two of these, so we definitely, we shattered the odds yet again on Firebox Breaks. We got two Sidney Crosby retrospective cards, and they are pretty solid looking indeed. So, that is your look at part two here on Firebox Breaks. You let me know what you thought about this particular break. So, as per usual, <clears throat> give me a quick second. Getting pretty hot, voice is getting perched, parched, all that good stuff. Now we will get to the outro. So like, comment, and subscribe for all that good stuff. And as always, I'll be back with more content in the near future. Till then, bye for now.